Lady Statesmen make it to Championship Sunday, a rubber match rematch with Arkansas Tech tomorrow at noon with a 72-60 win over Valdosta State. The Lady Statesmen played a full game. Valdosta State took certain aspects of the game away, including Mo Bell, Bug Cooper's ability to drive, Veronica Walker had a big half, Veronica finishing with 25 points to go along with 10 rebounds. Bug had 15 and 9 assists. Shamika Russell chipped in 10 points. It was Brittany Daniels that worked real hard and led the Lady Blazers with points of 16. But her post presence was enough to keep Sandra Rushing worried about the matchup tomorrow because the great post presence of Jessica Weatherford and the other, uh, Natalia Santos as well for Arkansas Tech. So it's going to be a matchup of two teams that have seen each other plenty this year. A great Tech crowd in their first game, their win to move to the championship. Also a great Lady Statesman crowd. So it'll be a battle of crowds and a battle of two very, very close teams in terms of what they do. It'll be a great matchup on Championship Sunday. We'll have that for you on the Statesman Sports Network if you can't make it. But come on out. It's at noon. It's a chance to see a five-peat. Never been done before. Sandra Rushing looking for her fifth, fifth straight conference championship. She's there for the fifth straight time, looking to strike it rich five in a row. Never been done before in the GSC. And Coach Sandra Rushing, very excited about the opportunity there. We'll have it for you. We'll have more coverage on Facebook.com slash DSU Statesman, GoStatesman.com slash Blogspot.com, and, of course, GoStatesman.com. It's a multimedia circus. We love doing it for you. But one more game. It's tomorrow at noon against Arkansas Tech. Tune on in or come on out to the DeSoto Civic Center for the Statesman Insider. I'm Jimmy Smith. Come on out Sunday at noon. We'll see you here at the DeSoto Civic Center in South Haven, Mississippi.